Isaac with the VOR, Isaac, Isaac Gabriel with the Watchmen Report, Isaac Gabriel here with the VOR broadcast. This is Martin Luther King's uh, Jr.'s day, a day of independence, a day when unity came. And I believe that one of the greatest unity that is coming to the body of Christ is God is touching families right now. I spent this weekend uh, with my family, my brothers, my sisters, my mom, uh, all my brothers-in-law, my sisters-in-law, and it was a powerful thing. You're going to see a little clip that I put together where the Lord fell on the entire family as I prayed for them. And it also, we were also talking about the transfer of anointing, how God is reaching generations. This is time for family revival. Prodigals are coming home. Children are, that have been away from God are going to be touched. I mean, family members that you thought that were that, that it was it for them. You keep praying. You keep believing. This year, I'm declaring that they're going to be saved. We're going to see a great family revival. This is a great awakening. Revival has come to this house. Everybody just lift your hands in the air and just receive. A fire of the Holy Ghost has come upon this family today. The anointing. Every yoke broken. Every yoke broken. Shh. You will do. Today begins your call to the Lord. He's going to lead your way. The issue you're healing, your eyes are coming right now. In Jesus' name, receive your healing. Receive your healing right now in Jesus' name. Receive your healing. Tell me you're being called into the ministry of the prophetess. Jacob, the Holy Spirit is upon you right now. It's upon the babies too. Revival has come to this house, Lord. And we just thank you. Not only will you be the ones, but wherever you go, there will be families revived. Families awakened in Jesus' name. After 6 o'clock, I think it's like 6.15, 6.30 in the morning. I'm about to head back, uh, back home. But I came here on a mission to pray with my family and to meet with my family. And God has answered my prayers. I sense unity coming to my family. And I also sense that many were baptized in the Spirit. And many were giving. The Holy Ghost was falling in conviction. You can see snow behind me. It is like 16 degrees or 12 degrees. I'm on my way back. My car is iced up, but it's okay. God has a mission. And I'm here in Waxahachie, Texas. Dallas, Texas, Fort Worth. If it's going to happen here, it's going to happen with your family. It's going to happen with your loved ones. It's going to happen. God is visiting his families. It's time for family revival. This is a year of action. This is a year of change. This is a year where God is moving in. And we're going to see an outpouring of his spirit like never before. And I'm just here to let you know that the God is doing something. And it's going to start with families. You're going to hear that broadcast come out very soon. We have videos coming out. The VOR is on a mission this time. The VOR has work to do. And I don't know about you, but I sense in my spirit that it's time to see the move. God, can you see the snowflakes behind me? It's cold. But it's worth coming down here. I want you to know that revival's not coming. It's here. A great awakening is around the corner. And it's starting with families. The children... The, the, the family members are coming together. This unit this unity is coming together. What has been divided will come together because God is raising up an army of people. This is the kingdom, families. This is a revival of generations. You get ready. Re Voice of Revival has a mission that wherever it goes, we will see the glory of God. We're going to see souls saved. We're going to see the outpouring of the Holy Spirit. We're going to see deliverance, signs, wonders, and miracles. This is why... We're, this is why the VOR Crusades is necessary. Can you imagine this multiplied as hundreds of families, thousands of families come together and get filled with the Holy Ghost and become activated into the mission of God. This is revival, friends. And you sometimes have to go out of your way, out of your comfort zone, even in the middle of ice and, and cold to do what the Lord's called you to do. This is the year to get up here to take action and do the will of the Lord. This is Isaac with the VOR broadcast radio show network.
I don't know where the Lord is leading us, but I know revival is coming to your family. Do you believe it? Then receive it. Will you become a voice of revival for your generation? God bless you. Until next time. Bye-bye.